So this is the gas mixing setup for the laser. Um, it all goes through this little manifold here, which is just made of polyurethane block. It's all fairly low pressure, so it should be fine. Um, helium from one rusty helium tank. And nitrogen from scrubbed air pumped in from the bicycle pump. Goes through a couple of little uh, stones in each of those. And then uh, carbon dioxide from welding gas. And they go loop de loop through that hose to the balloon. You have to have a shut off valve on each of the gas supplies, otherwise the higher pressure gas will just squeeze into the lower pressure gas, as in it'll flow backwards into the water. So this is laser gas mix balloon diameters um, by ratio. It has to be filled in the order there, helium, CO2, nitrogen. Um, so the ratios are the first ones, example circumferences in the second, and then those ones down there are actually diameters derived from those ones. Um, easy enough. Good. So gas comes out there. <whistles> around through the needle valve. It doesn't close off properly, but it's okay. And then into got that second that hand on eBay the tube and um, the mirrors on in this are just solid copper um polished with brasso more or less and um, just stuck on with clip towel so this is the other end output end another copper mirror with a 2.5 mil hole um, there's a little o-ring and then a zinc selenide flat window. That's the uh, bit there. And the power supply is an oil burner ignition transformer there. Running through bridge rectifier. They're dialed out of microwave ovens. Not really sure if they're the right thing to use, but... Seems to work. And then they come out through those at this end. And then connect on there. And there. What do you think? No, not interested. There I go.